Hi, welcome to Weird Group. Let me take you on a tour of our technology ecosystem. Weird Group was established in 2009 and had focused on the development of three technology fields augmented reality, virtual reality, and artificial intelligence. We have worked on thousands of projects in over 20 countries around the world. We have collaborated with various international and national companies. Some of our partners and clients include Hello. We focus on developing immersive technology solutions for smart society through technologies such as AR, VR, and AI. Now, similar to Web 1 with computers and internet, and Web 2 with smartphones, Web 3 will emerge through wearables like smart glasses and smart lenses. In this new phase, AR, VR, and AI will play a very crucial role. Currently, we collaborate with several partners as hardware providers. Now let's take a look at our ecosystem. I will help explain the technology ecosystem of our business units. Currently, our units consist of AR & Co, Dove, DMID, Mindstores, and Mata Republic. Before that, do you know the difference between AR and VR? Augmented reality or AR is like seeing the world through a magical lens that overlays digital information, images, or even games onto your real-world view using devices like tablets or AR glasses or smartphones. Meanwhile, virtual reality or VR is like stepping through a portal into another universe, completely immersing yourself in a digital world that can be as realistic or fantastical as you can imagine using VR glasses like this. Our first business unit is AR & Co, which focuses on developing the future of interaction by bridging businesses and consumers, enabling interaction between the real world and the virtual world through technologies such as AR, VR, AI, motion tracking, and sound voice recognition. Here's an example of AR being applied in the retail and fashion industries. Using a smart mirror, we can try on headwear, clothes, makeup, or glasses without physically trying them on. We have implemented this solution in several projects, including the G20 Summit in Bali back in 2022. This is also an example of AR implementation where we aim to introduce people to digital objects like this avatar of famous painter Afandi. Through AR, we help people to interact with prominent figures virtually. AR & Co. also implements AR, VR, and AI for various industries, ranging from the property and real estate industry, education, culture, to FMCG. With the help of our other business unit, DMID, which provides strategic advice to help brands in building their relevancy with the market. Next is our business unit called Dove. Dove is an everyday life solution for the community that uses IoT or the Internet of Things. Simply put, Dove is a smart machine that can do many things. One of the forms of Dove machines is like this. We have deployed thousands of Dove machines in high traffic public areas, such as mini markets with various functions ranging from media placement to commerce for purchasing products that are not available in stores, such as electronics, medicine, or even furniture. The interesting part is that Dove can also be used by brands for activations considering the limited space available in mini markets. Without having to play sales promoter or banner, brands can use Dove to provide information to consumers, interact through gamification, and much more. As a smart machine, Dove can switch functions and become a one-stop solution for various purposes, like this vending machine that can be placed at international airports. Now, this Dove machine functions to help foreign tourists with all their needs upon arriving in Indonesia, from arranging visa on arrival to buying local SIM cards and exchanging foreign currency with e-money cards containing rupiah. You can directly get the SIM card and e-money card from this machine too. In addition to that, we have also placed Dove in the domestic departure area for self-check-in and face recognition purposes. 
The possibilities for Dove are endless. For example, Dove can be used in the hospitality industry for hotel self check-ins in the healthcare industry, and Dove can be used for telemedical consultation, health analysis, or even doctor's appointment booking. In the banking industry, Dove can be used as a virtual customer service or even for transactions. Next one is MindStores. MindStores offers the future of commerce through the development of a virtual store network for brands and retailers. One of the implementations of MindStores is in the form of AlphaMind. Together with AlphaMart, MindStores have built a virtual retail store network since 2017, targeting communities in second and third tier cities, allowing them to open the virtual AlphaMart stores. With AlphaMind, store owners can sell products to those around them. It's not limited to products available in AlphaMart, but also up to more than 20 thousands of goods that are not available in AlphaMart. What sets this solution apart from e-commerce is the format. In AlphaMind, the format is social commerce, where store owners are encouraged to proactively offer their products directly to potential buyers in their community. This includes neighbors, social groups, and others. With the Mind Stores platform, store owners do not need to worry about managing inventory and logistics because everything will be handled by Alphamart or by the principal brands. All products can be picked up by buyers at the nearest Alphamart or delivered directly to their location. Let's continue. Next is Mata Republic that focuses on developing Web3 technologies such as Metaverse, Blockchain, and P2E or Play to Earn. The first product under Mata Republic is Minar. Minar is a game platform that connects consumers with brands through geolocation-based gamification. Through Minar, users are asked to physically explore the city and search for virtual Minar stones that are scattered in various locations. As for finding Minar stones, users can break them to get coins that can be exchanged for vouchers from participating brands. By using geolocation, Minar stones can be spread in various locations desired by the brand. For example, a brand wants to target consumers in a specific area, Minar can spread specific stones with incentives from the brand in the desired locations. We have even spread Minar stones overseas, such as in Malta and Switzerland. Next is the newest product under Mata Republic, Nusa Meta. Nusa Meta is our metaverse platform where we are building a virtual world on top of our own blockchain for the future of the internet of Web3. More than a hundred brands are ready to jump on the metaverse by building their virtual premises on Nusa Meta. We are also preparing an ecosystem for digital creators by providing them with creator tools so they can create various digital objects that will have utility in Nusa Meta soon. Thank you for taking your time to get to know us better. Hope you get a better understanding of our business. So are you ready to enter the future with Weird Group?